Davenport joins us and haven't seen you here, Coach, but you know what? Some things never change. What a great second half by the Knights. Well, it was, but, you know, what an honor. I mean, the tremendous facility we're playing in, and, you know, I, I give so much credit to Maryville. That's why this is the best league in the country. you got a coach, Kevin Carroll, who is as good a young coach at any level as there is anywhere. And, and they're playing their best basketball, coming off a tremendous win against Umsel, a win in the conference tournament against USI in overtime. We knew this was going to be a tremendous challenge because of our respect for their entire basketball program. And, you know, they outscored us 21 in the first half from the three-point line. It's hard to overcome that. But I give our guys a tremendous amount of credit, especially the leadership of our three captains, George Suggs, Jake Thielen, and, and Corbin Maynard. What was the halftime message? I can only imagine what well, it was you were about, saying. It was about defense. We only had, we had one assist, 11 turnovers. Right. So you're not going to shoot a great percentage. They had 13 more shots than us. I mean, it, it was all about defense. But, again, part of that, you got to give you got to give Maryville a lot of credit. Cause, and we do have that much respect for them. Trust me. We had to play them five games back at third place. We knew the type of challenge this was going to be. Absolutely, Coach. And now looking forward to uh, a lot of great things, the semifinal, and obviously a lewis u Indy matchup here next. You get the winner of that on Saturday. Well, we do. And it's, I mean, it's the best conference in the country, hands down the best conference in the country. So this is what you're going to see playing teams as good as Lewis, as good as Parkside. I mean, they're NCAA tournament teams. They're veteran teams. They're, they're tremendously well-coached teams, and that'll be a heck of a college basketball game. Absolutely, Scott. Great seeing you again, and great job. Well, i got to give a big shout-out to all our people at home. <laughs> they're snowed in. Well, we had, we had just under 12 inches of snow wow. last night, and I know through all the social media, a lot of people watch this game on this network, and trust me, these guys know that too, and they appreciate it. It's the same people that were filling up Knights Hall, and, and you're all the best, and, and you know, take care of our city for us. And if you can get over here Saturday, come on over. We'd love to have you, but I know it's the whole city and the state's under under tremendous duress right yeah. now. I mean, it's just tough. And, you know, our thoughts and prayers, those people at home, stay safe. We, we felt your, your vibes all the way over here. Trust me, this is a great facility. If you get over here, we'd love to have them. Absolutely. A lot of fun bringing it back to the fans of Louisville. So, Scott, good luck uh, on Saturday. Hopefully we'll talk to you Saturday afternoon. Thank you, guys. Appreciate Scott it. Scott Davenport Thank joins us. We'll be back in a moment right here with final numbers and final thoughts. Bellarmine wins. They advance to the semifinals on Saturday right here on the GLVC Sports Network. Perfect.